I work in the pharmacy at a hospital. Pharmacy, you have any kids? Four. Four kids. How old are your four kids? 22, 15, 14, and 11. All by the same man? Oh, yeah. Were, have you been married? No. No, but I was in a um a 16-year relationship. It's just, you know. I was, Why did I get married? I got four kids together. Because I was really young. So I was in a relationship since I was 14. And so, like, as I got older and matured, I realized, like, what the fuck we got going on? Like, yeah, that's not it. So, yeah. Okay. And, okay. So we got Renita, Miami, 39, Aries, works at a pharmacy. Excuse me. A mom of four kids by the same man. Never married. What kind of man are you looking for, love? Um, Just, like, consistent employed with his own everything because i know like down here in miami everybody want to say the cost of living thing but like you know if you got to live with your mom and stuff like that i just can't do that i just can't do that so i ain't asking for much i just want you to be consistent i like to have fun i like to travel i like to go bowling i like to do fun stuff like i don't like the what you're doing what you do don't what you're doing me to death please don't do that i i don't have it um, okay what are your deal breakers uh my deal breakers is um newport smokers and cigarette smokers i can't do that um if you're unemployed i just absolutely can't i understand the transitioning or oh, i'm applying i get it and that's great but it's just not great for me so if you're unemployed if you smoke cigarettes or if you live with your mom that's gonna be a deal breaker I'll tell you what, to the logical minded folks, they will say she's not asking for a lot, but to men on the date market, she is. I mean, at this point, you probably got to pay to play a house. Yeah. She, this woman, the, the, the skinny of it, she's 40 with four kids. Don't, you know, if she was four for four, it makes it more nasty. See, that's, that's the only difference. It's big and so small at the same time. Four kids by one guy, the stepdaddy, just still a big, a full kid headache. Ain't no way around that. But four for four, now it's just, it's laughable. 100% laughable at that point. But yeah, 40, four kids. Talking about you can't, can't live in your mom's house. That's who she been get um, approached by. Because well, that's that, who her baby daddy is. Kendra uh, said, all by the same man. She said, yeah, unfortunately. This guy's still in his mom's basement, more than likely. <laughs> she said, we met did. in high school. I was 14. That is asterisk. She's trying, she trying to give all these disclaimers. And... See what I'm saying? Listen, what did the godfather say? You get no higher than your baby daddy. You're locked in, sister. <laughs> oh, here we go. <laughs> okay. So he looked a certain way. Um, I'm five seven, so if you can be five ten or above, that's cool. Um, I just if you have a beard, I like it to be tamed. I need I need you to have all all your teeth in your mouth. Side teeth need to be intact. Um, we're not gonna do the yellow buttery thing. Uh, hygiene is very important. <laughs> so yeah. That's... Okay, and should he make a certain amount of money? Yeah, we gonna need him to make a certain amount of money. <laughs> How much money does he need to make? We gonna go. Um, yeah, we know we down here in Miami, Kendra. We gonna need you to be in the. Um, we got to get you up in the six figures. Um, but if you don't make six figures, like when I say, I, I see a lot of women say, "Oh, as long as he can maintain himself." When I say maintain yourself, I don't mean you're able to pay your rent. I mean, like, you're able to pay your rent and we can go to brunch and we can, you know, you know, do some fun stuff, like do things, live life. I don't want you to work just to pay bills. If you can only work just to pay bills, then yeah, because I'm going to leave you. I I'm I'm about to go. Huh. You can't make this shit up. You can't make this shit up. Y'all heard it. But men, women don't want men for their money, Mr. Walker. This woman said, if you ain't got the money, I'm just going to serve you a black pill and go. <laughs> I like the way she say Miami. She sound familiar. Down here in Miami. 
Gotta be making six figures. Again, there's logic there. That's not all madness. She got four kids. What you gonna do for her? Her four kids coming there making fifty thousand dollars. What you gonna do for her in Miami and four children? Nothing. So if you dumb enough, I'm sorry. If you man enough, <laughs> all right, to step into this, you better have a hundred k. Cause only a real man with a hundred k could dare deal with uh, Renita. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Did your children's dad make six figures? Yeah, over that. But we go. We 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 go. That's another topic for another oh. time. But yeah, yeah. Oh. I, listen, I only ask for what I'm used to and what I can contribute. Also, I don't ask nobody for nothing that I'm not used. To. If I was used to um a dude with an EBC, I say he need uh five hundred dollars on his EBC. But I'm not used to that, so I'm willing to accept that. It. You know what I mean? Like this, I ain't going backwards. I can't. Oh. Stop lying. Why you lying, ho? Stop lying. Crazy. I know the time, ho. I Stop the lying. G's, what we slide, Stop. No. So now her baby daddy was a high value man, but it's a long story. <laughs> high, yeah, long story. Stop. Maybe he was a high earner, and that's why I like to specify high earner, high value. High earner houseway street pharmacist. If it's a long story about how he was a high earner, because I ain't hearing this high value madness, most likely was a street pharmacist out there in Miami. You she looks like one of them women. She likes them drug dealing ninjas. Mm -hmm. So shout out to Airstrike Debo. Appreciate said, the airstrike come through. Okay. Says you ain't six figure worthy, but you can get these <laughs> for free though. These what was that? These arrows? These these airstrikes? Shout out to Airstrike Depot. <laughs> Appreciate you, brother. Yeah. So it's over. Let's see. I guess we'll look at the Kendra cam. I think we're close to it. Let's there we see. go. See, because she may be. Kendra Cam could save her, could send her up to Glaze Galaxy. <laughs> Is she twerking late? She twerking so. Let's see. She orange. Why is she orange? Shout out to the orange man. Why is she orange though? <laughs> Are your kids? She's 22. Okay. Ooh. Turn around on her. Turn around. <laughs> oh, don't, don't start twerking, girl. Okay. I almost did, right? I was like, hold on, wait. <laughs> so there we go. And she said she got a 20, a 22 year old daughter. Good luck. See what I'm saying? Competing with your daughter for real, for real. That's what you're doing. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, she, if she would have twerked out, I said sitting in the Glaze Galaxy, but that was unimpressive. <laughs> it really was. This is like a yeah. grandma twerk. Yeah, it's not, no. Nah. She did a little hip toss, a little pop. <laughs> she got her wet and wavy wig on. And... There you go. Look like she got like an orange spray tan going. That's what's up. See if the bioluminescence or something like that ish. Because this ain't it. There we go. She Wait a minute. Yeah, because she got full. She, did she get divorced? She wasn't married. Yeah, bioluminescence. <laughs> The passengers of the doomed Titanic sub spent their last moments in total darkness looking for bioluminescent creatures out of the small window and listening to their favorite music. The new details of the five passengers' final moments have been revealed by the wife and mum of the father-son duo. Wait in the water, wait in the water, time and wait in the water. Something's gonna trouble the water. You better wait in the water. Yeah, Appreciate your divine photos. Said she said something very telling. She's 39 and looking for a vibe, red flag. When do we reach a point and tell these women to grow the F up? 30 and up, you shouldn't say vibe. I amen to that. I'm for these hardcore lines in the sand. I can't stand that stuff. Like, take pride in growing older and being mature. You ain't no grandma. You a grandma. Go knit something and bake something. <laughs> that part. <laughs> Shout out to Skinny Boy. Says, all right, gun line Lisa or Nuglet Natasha? 
for Nug Nug, for Nuglet Natasha. Yeah, for Nuglet Natasha for Nug Nug. Gun line Lisa gonna hurt Nug Nug out here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Appreciate your Coleman Technology Inc. Says my family and I went to Miami a month ago. She is out of her league. You sink to him, brother. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Reporting mm-hmm. back from the front lines. <laughs> Hit the like button. Shout out to Airstrike Debo. 